The Yetzara is always going to be here. It's an unbelievable thing. Yetzara, the enemy is here all the time. No matter how much you beat him, you still have more worse to go. Your whole life, like the Misilat Sharim says in the first chapter, you are a soldier in this world. A Jew is a soldier in this world. In between two wars, in front of him and in back of him, the Yetzara is surrounding him all the time, always thinking, how can I make this guy fall? How can I trick him? How can I put him in the world of the illusion that life is about fame, life is about money and food and entertainment? How do I get him? How do I get him? He always wants to trick you. The first step to beat the Yetzara, says him in Sharim, is first being aware of the middle of a war. If you don't know your middle of a war, you're for sure going to lose. So the first step is recognizing your enemy, says in Misirat al-Sharim, every single day of our lives. The Yetzara always wants to pull away your heart. He always wants to acquire your heart towards the wrong path, the wrong direction. And that's what we say every day, don't go after that part of your heart. Be aware that you're in the middle of a war. This life is about working. This life is about accomplishing. This life is not about relaxing. If a person thinks he's in this world to relax, he will have a hard time. This life is about building, building, building and accomplishing. Every time you control the Yitzhara, every time you say no to a sin, every time you control your eyes, every time you keep Shabbat, you beat the war again and again and again. But it's a full-time war until your last day of this world, until 120. But be aware, Yitzhara is always out to the gate. Thank you for listening to the Guard Your Eyes Daily Chizuk Broadcast. Pass them on to your friends and help spread Kedusha in the world.